25 minutes. Nope, too bad. I was planning on giving to give you a special banana if you deliver them all under three minutes. But I guess you really you don't really want one. You insolent little monkey. <laughs> Hey you! How long are you gonna stay unconscious, stupid monkey? All right, let's hear it. Oh, she can't. Oh, she can't hold. All right. I thought there was gonna be a cutscene there. Welcome back to Mother Three. Last time we had to deliver happy boxes for Facade, and we have no idea what they do. So, and now we have to uh, go uh, up here. Two things I forgot to mention, unless I can see them now. One thing I forgot to mention is... Oh, there's a box here. Oh, I didn't see it. Edible mushroom. There's one here. And in here... Oh, no. Oh, they got opened. Cool. Okay. There's, like, normally a bunch of items in there. Okay, these are... And these are acorns that you can take out. Cool. Right? Yeah, I guess. Okay, let's go up here. Like we were told to do. This whole entire thing is right now just do what we're told to do. Sketch of the area. Wow. I'm pretty sure there's something. Yes. Okay. Got a doorknob. Hey! Don't pick up cheap doorknobish looking things like that. Come on, let's go, quick dawdling. <laughs> the return of the doorknob. Ha ha. Wait, who's over here? Wait, what? That's cool. Uh, does have any purpose to go up here? I swear, the lady in this painting keeps staring at me. So I've decided to stare right back at her. I'm staring back with all of my might. Okay. Okay, I'm trying to... We're supposed to, uh, go here? Mr. Facade, sir, I'm currently thinking about how to dispose of this bronze statue. I'm putting my life on the line to get it done. Okay. Sure, let's jump down. Okay. Aren't we supposed to, like... Oh yeah, we're supposed to go down the front, but I decided to take the long way around. Okay. What's going on? Did you find it? What? You still haven't found it? Just who are these other intruders? Squee! Old man and a guy with a gloomy feel about him? You mean- wait, you mean him? The guy with the brown hair, gloomy look, slightly bad breath, and look, kinda looks like a bum. So, where are they now? Good question. Very good question. What? They're headed for the top floor. You fools! Whatever you do, do not let them get there first. Okay. Oof. Take that, bud. Okay. Guess our goal is now to go to the top floor, too. Unless we're supposed to go through here. It used to be filled with ghosts. Alright, now we gotta head to the top floor. With all these beat up suits of armor. Up here. I think they just feed us information that we're supposed to go to the top floor. Yeah, can't go that way. Can't go that way. Bah, dead end. Alright, monkey, let's look elsewhere. Okay. Can't go that way, because that's blocks. Okay. You do. You just keep walking in place there. Yeah? What? They fled into the basement? They have it with them? Alright, got it. Hey, monkey, you're heading into the basement now. There should be an entrance to the basement somewhere inside this castle. Find it. Okay. Alright, now we have to head to the basement. We're chasing after them. Chasing after Duster, Kumatora, and Les in the basement. Here it is. It's the, uh, what are these things called? I forget them. 
Oh, they're cute. I got the names of them right now. Oh, and here's a new enemy. You could fight them before. Now you can. Stick up on a big bro. Let's apologize. Dab. Got him. Okay, continuing on. Now what we want to do is look at all these pictures. Oh, that's depicted here. Learn Osahi Dance Part A. Learn Osahi Dance Part B. And Part C. Nah, I think you know where this is going. Alright, we go through here. Hey, stupid monkey. Do something to open it. Now, if you press right, after doing all of them, you do this. And... Ba-boom! It opens! Oh, well done! Alright, here's your reward. You're seriously an asshole. <laughs> Come on, let's get going. Okay. You can go back. Okay, it just allows me to go in and out, okay. I thought if it actually did close, you had to do the dance again, so you don't have any excuse to not see it again. Oh, I'm not a ghost, I'm a frog. Save your game? Sure! You're a ghost frog, I guess. Here we go. Alright, so the next frog you see. Okay. Pisces bracelet, huh? Yeah. Neat. Uh, let's get rid of this, this bracelet. Get rid of the Aquarius bracelet. And pick up the Pisces bracelet, because I'm pretty sure that's better. Yeah, it's better. Shouldn't have dropped it, but whatever. Cheers, skeleton! Uh... Flash. Ha! Take that, bud. Take that! Lost interest off. You're a bone! Take that! Got him. Level 10. Yay. Okay. Oh, there's a little bro. Which is ironic, because, well... Yeah. Let's use an item that has lower healing. Wait. Drop this. Uh, use one of these and pick up... Beef jerky will trade it. Why can I not just walk over that? Okay. This big, uh, little bro, little big bro. That's what it is. Let's make you laugh. Yay! Hit ya! Boom! Boom! Lost interest, dang. That. That. Ow. Hit me. Take that. Yeah. And beef jerky. Awesome. Speaking of which, we should eat the uh, nut bread. And let's continue on. We go through here? No, locked on the other side. Okay, darn. Okay. Ow. Hit me. I dare you. Hit me. It's dangerous. I'm gonna heal again. Ow. The 
Before you do the monkey deliver service thing, I'd recommend you pick up those items. This is actually quite a bunch of items, uh, quite a lot of items in there. And they disappear after you do the uh, delivery service, and I, and you can only pick them up during that, I think. I'm not sure, but, yeah. Beef jerky. Pull the switch. Why not? You do it, son. Huh? What's this level? What's this lever for? Hey, pull this lever. Okay. Oh, uh, oh, this looks familiar. What? It's them! They fled into the waterway! What? They skipped the item! After them! After them! After them! After them! Now go after them! No wait, they're inside. Quarter them, is what I said. Contact me the instant you find them. Bah! There's not a single useful person here. One part's right. Let's return to the auto hit for now. Okay. Uh, I'll go up here, ancient banana. I'll take it. Go up here. Ooh. Uh. Save. Continue on. Like, sorry if I'm not talking much, but like, uh, uh, there's not a lot going on. You're just kind of going back and forth between the story. Like, uh, a lot of dialogue here, but I know the series is good for that. Oh, there's these new tanks. That's nice. Strange vehicle is sitting here. That's a fucking tank, dude. Oh yeah, we've got the fucking. I know who you are, but you best be careful if you're going inside the that castle. Some guys dressed up like pigs went in and are up to no good. Yup, we're part of them. Oh, there's blue one! What are you doing? One of you two, get it out of my way! Hey! You heard Mr. Facade! Fall back! He was looking at you when he said it. You fall back! Shut up! I don't give a damn about any of that. Both of you get out of my way now! <sighs> Yo, he like serious. He's... Just look how late it is now! You're so stupid! So your fault, you idiot. He was looking at you when he said that. So you're the idiot, you idiot. I know you are, but what am I? You idiot! Both of you idiots! Go find them now! <sighs> Okay. Gotta go down here, I think. Uh, yeah, we gotta go down here. Alright, isn't this where it- yeah, okay. That's where it starts off. This is the end of the third chapter, uh, second chapter right now. Besides, I bet you're, a, you're the one who let Duster get away in the first place! I have done no such thing, nor would I have any need to. My goodness! I simply can't believe that someone would steal money I so humbly gave you! True then. Perhaps this village really is starting to become cursed. Bullshit. You can't allow Tasmanian Village to become such a dismal hive for evildoers to run amok. We all must seek. We must all seek happiness. And this village will be in great danger. Oh no, it's you. The Torah senses something about me. Oh, what's this? Are you fond of that nice lady there? Uh, kinda. Come now! I'll give you lots and lots of luxury bananas later. So let us return to the Yada Inn. 
Okay, a little salsa. Yeah, that's really good, uh, bananas, dude. High quality. I love the citrusy flavor. Oh! Hey, stupid monkey! Did you still don't understand the situation you're in? Well, I kinda do, you're just a jerk. If you ever disobey me, or try any funny business in the slightest, I'll make sure your beloved girly monkey winds up in some serious trouble. Remember that? Uh, I did everything like you said. Now go to sleep! I did everything you said, jerk. Salsa's crying. That's what the little shake did, in case you were wondering. <clears throat> the middle of the night. Hey! Hey, monkey! Rescue you! That cheap bastard's asleep! Hurry here! Okay. You're better people than him, that's for sure. You're safe now. Don't know how you got involved with that lie spew and fraud, but you must have had your reasons, I guess. Poor little thing. Princess, this is a great deed you have done. Now, let's go find that lazy moron, I mean Duster, and that egg he has with him. I know he's alright. Morons like him never get sick or hurt, no matter where they go or what they do. Yeah. We just gotta find Duster and the egg. First, let's free this monkey. Geezer, go steal that zapper gizmo while that lion freak's still asleep. Oh, right. I must have swiped it earlier. I should have swiped it earlier. I'll be right back. Be free in a minute, monkey. You must have had it rough. Uh... I just got shocked. Monkey, I, sell the, I stole the doohickey. I accidentally bumped in on the way back. Did it zap you? Sorry about that. Here, monkey, you destroy it. Oh, would I ever like to. Ow! Alright, monkey, you can go wherever you want to now. You're free. You got something keeping you from running away. What is it? Samba. Oh, your girlfriend's been kidnapped. Or monkey napped, I should say. Damn, that cheap bastard. He's screwed up. You don't say. Oh, did you call for me? I happen to be that screwed up cheap bastard you speak of. To think I would ever get to meet you here, of all places, Princess Kumatora. <laughs> Stupid monkey. Did you think you could get away from me? He can! And we're gonna let him! Geezer! Monkey! You ready? Two... Three! This when we run! Got it? Uh... Damn, they're fast! And go! <laughs> After them! Don't let them escape! <laughs> they're headed your way! I see. They remain there on standby. I'll be there shortly. Up ahead, then. 
<laughs> There's no escape from me. No <laughs> Escape through the forest! Or join your party! Yeah! Let's join your party! Yeah! Alright, let's go. Trap you. Here's new big mask enemies. They're typically fairly average for now, but they're still pretty new enemies regardless. They're weak to fire and that other fun stuff. Oh, wait, I didn't know. Whatever. That. Oof. Nice, Wes. Alright, there we go. Pick mask surrendered. You won! 61 points. Nice. Frozen bag of pork chips. Oh, that's a pretty good handing item. Bleh. Uh, one of those things. Wait, we already read that sign. I'm not very dumb. Okay. Making sure I don't overwrite the old one just in case. And here. You look. I thought I would be in this kind of position. This is very awkward. Hi. Oh. Like. No, I'm not gonna talk about that. I'm not gonna talk about that. I forget I ever thought of that. Uh. Yeah, let's dance. Let's just attack. Well, dance! Whoa, my speed went up! Worry about safety. Take that. I did look nothing. Let's do thunder. Get wrecked. We won! Awesome. Enemies over here. Uh oh, we hear a revving. Whoop well, tank! Uh. Whoa! Damn, no luck here either. Chance of choice to go back now? Oh, crap. Uh oh. We're surrounded. It's attacking! Here's Chapter 3's boss fight! Major boss fight at least! A port tank suddenly attacked! Oh boy, this is why I saved my bombs. Oh, all the running bombs! And use thunder! Thunder. What I typically do is. Oof. You want to throw your bombs if you can, and heal. Thunder. That's typically what you want to do. It fires every round until a certain point, which I'll let you know when it happens. It's pretty obvious when it happens, so. Eh. Monkey Mimic, and I'm gonna heal, uh, Salsa on that turn. HIT ME! HIT ME! This! Yeah, he does a lot of damage. Let's, uh, use an ancient banana, why not? And let's... I'm so used to late game where you could actually heal everything. Damage, that's actually not bad. Oh, I didn't hit anyone. Come on. Ow. That was close. Uh, 
running bomb. I don't have any assist to uh, lower its stats. That sucks. Can it just be destroyed? You want to toss her? <laughs> oh god! Please don't hit salsa. No! 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 Oh, 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 and there we go. Poor Tech was wrecked. Take that. Got him. Jam. Nice. Take that. Music thunder on it. See the part technique. What's that, Wes? Through a cannonball. Ow. Oh, actually. Alright, Wes, it's up to you. Think that's uh, oh, we have 38, okay. So we got black smoke. Oh, we just keep attacking. In this state, it's very hard for it to kill you, so I was hoping like it would die soon. Close. Pig mask and plane. Okay. And there we go! Salsa's is not hard, it's just, like, as you can tell, Salsa is not best at, like, taking hits and, like, in its first stage it does a lot of damage. So you gotta be careful on the first stage, and not, like, if I had any existing items it would probably help, but I didn't, so, yeah. Yeah. Hmm? What's that? Facade! Oh god, another tank. Now then, Princess Kumatora, I ask that you behave and do as I say. Lucas? Get out of here! Who are you? Get out of here, you stupid kid! Stupid kid! Drago! Oh my poor! What's the baby Drago doing here? You baby Drago, get out of here! Plus, stupid kid. Like, I'm not mashing it, it just goes by automatically. Oh, oh. Oh. Oh, no. Hi! Whoa! Okay. Uh... Oh yeah! We got Drago, bitch! Take that! Whoa! Go! You got, you got, you got tank, we got a frickin' Drago, dude. <laughs> really? The guy in the tank just gets out. Hey! Get back here, you! No, stop. Stop! Don't, please! Ha <laughs> Feeling like better now, monkey? No, he's not dead yet. What? Oh! Get him! your mother passed away. But what you did just now was wonderful. You saved our lives. 
Thank you, Lucas. All oh, right, gotta say hi. Hi, nice to meet you, and thanks. You didn't even know. You didn't even know what was going on, huh? But you saved our lives. It's probably a little late for it now, but you should ask this geezer what's about what's going on. Yeah, that'd be kind of important. Sure, I can fill you in on everything. Will you will you listen, Lucas? Yeah. Well, it goes like this. Convenient cut. And that's everything that's happened. No, Lucas, you stay here in Taz Village. Certain claws will come back sooner or later. I'd like you and Flint and the others to work together to protect our village. Oh, I intend to help too, of course. What little I can, at least. Princess, I leave the monkey in your hands. Oh, and search for that moron, too. Lucas, don't know why, but I somehow get the feeling I'll be seeing you again. Take care of yourself. Okay, monkey, let's go. Let's go! That's the end of chapter three! As Millie is now transforming ex exactly how the newly cut peddler had planned. Only a handful of villagers realize that things are that were good and right are being tossed away one after the other. Although prosperity is increasing, the eerie darkness seems to be growing heavier over the village at the same time. However, within that darkness, a frail young boy grows ever stronger. Soon L Lucas will repaint this tale of sadness with a bright new color. The deeper the darkness, the brighter the sunrise at dawn. The once coddled Lucas is now on his way to becoming a brilliant young son. Literally and figuratively. Ha! Ah, got ya. Hello, I'm a frog. Shall I record everything that has happened so far? Sure. Do I want to continue the episode? There's kind of more stuff, but... Eh, what the heck, let's continue a little bit more. Oops, memories. We're gonna be ending it soon, just saying. You can probably tell by the watch time.
This brings back memories of the beginning of the game. So we'll change out. Memories. <clears throat> From now on, we're gonna play as the main character, which is now Lucas. Let me let, show you a few things about Lucas before I uh, end the episode. Status: We start off at level 10. Offense: 30, 45. Defense: 22. IQ: 16. 10 speed. And we actually know PSI. What PSI we have is very minimal, but still, it's something. Goats. Pretty sure they're goats. Oh, they're sheep. Like the scary. Yes, they, it is scary. Surprisingly scary. There's a pig mask outside, but. We're gonna have to end this episode. Bony! My boy! Whoop! Okay, alright. I'll take you for a walk. Uh oh. I was supposed to talk to him. My bad. Okay. Now we have. Hey, you there, boy. I realize this might be a bit of a bother, but please come talk to me. Very important information for you. Alright, we have to learn one more thing. Back up. Let's talk to you. From this day forth, you shall be rewarded for your hard work. It must be given in units called DP, Dragon Power. You can use DP in shops and other places in exchange for goods and services. It seems you have already earned 30 DP so far. You can save and withdraw DP anytime by talking to nearby frogs. Some frogs in special locations can't conduct DP transactions, though. Shall I explain that again? No, thank you. Alright then, let's try it out. It flies, doesn't it? Yeah, it's like it's been a whole thing. Sure. We're just gonna save for now. Next episode! In the next episode of Mother 3! We're going to continue on in Chapter 4, playing as Lucas, and heading to presumably a new location in a new time. And our town is now completely changed. See you guys then.